They know whenever I come through, I'm stepping in. I'm with the game, what you repping? Yo, you know what it is? It's Marlo. This is I'm not a sneakerhead. Let's talk about some sneakers, man. All right, so today we got a pair of 350s. These are my first 350s. As y'all know, if y'all watch my videos, y'all know I say on plenty of videos, I never really been a fan of the 350s, and that's why I wasn't really into Yeezys because I ain't know about other silhouettes. But I got a 350 now. I entered on the Confirm app for the Yeezy 350 Oreo, and I hit. Anytime you hit on the confirm app, it's always decent. And then I hit for a 350. The 350 Oreo, as y'all know, originally released in 2016 and it just restocked. Now, this is supposed to be one of the more classic Yeezy 350 V2s. But before I get out to the shoe, man, let's bust it down. You know what I'm saying? We got sneakers. Let's see what I think about it since I know for a fact I ain't no 350 fan. I'm excited to see what I think because I actually think it's about to change some things. Oh. Alright man, 350s. What? My first pair of 350s and they the Oreos. They really call it the core black, core white 350 V2s, but you know, we call them the Oreos, you know what I'm saying? Let's bust it open and see what it looks like. Okay. These bitches kinda hard, I ain't gonna lie. I'm turned out. I'm turned out and I'm turned up. 350 Oreo. Damn, I think this just made me a fan of the 350s. Alright. Cause I know I don't like 350s, you know what I'm saying? It's kinda crazy for me, but as y'all see, you know what I'm saying? Anytime we got like a mostly black Yeezy, that's always a hit, especially for me, cause a lot of my wardrobe is all black, but you know. We got the all black Yeezy 350 V2 with the, I guess it's supposed to be a white stripe supply 350 on the side, but it looked more like a tan, you know what I'm saying? Like in a tan nude realm. And I gotta say, man, I kinda like this sneaker. I think it's, I think it's decent, man. I think it's decent. I don't know. I won't know until I get it on foot and see how I feel about it on foot. I think I'm just excited to have a 350 because I spent all this time not liking 350s and for what reason, I don't know. Most of them I don't like though. I don't know. I don't know what it is about 350, but having it in hand right now, it's kind of, it's kind of changed. I'm feeling the vibe, man. We got this all black midsole with the all black I want to say, what's this, a knit material? Oh, yeah, like a knit material upper. And we got the speckles of, you can see like a bunch of speckles of cream hints in there on the shoe, which make it a nice little touch to it. Making it not an all black shoe, or making it an all black shoe with a little pop to it, you know what I'm saying? Then we got the Supply 350 stripe going around the side, wrapping around to the back. Supply 350 fading out on the back. And I think this is a hard sneaker, man. It's my first 350. Shout out to the Confirm app for letting me hit on this. I'm definitely gonna be excited to wear these and see what I think about them after wearing them for a day. Sizing on these, I chose to go a half size up. Most people along with the website recommend that you go a half size up on these. So I went a half size up on them. Let me see, I'm putting it on my foot right quick and see how I feel about that. Easy 350. Oreo. I don't know y'all, they might turn me out with this one. Uh, ooh, having it on foot. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely just got into the 350s. Uh, this half size up is, it's a nice comfortable size. Um, it looks like, I, it feels like I got some extra room but it, it, it feels like i don't got no extra room at the same time so i would say going a half size up it's probably a safe bet i think if i went true to size it'll probably be a little too tight because of how narrow the shoe is at at the front i definitely think you should probably go a half size up on these but it's feeling like a little room in them though but they not tied so if i time i'm sure they give me that ankle support that I'm looking for but as far as the rest of the shoe though yeah it's definitely a nice comfortable fit these are super comfortable I ain't gonna lie these super comfortable 
So half size up on these, you know what I'm saying? 350 V2 Oreo, what you think, P? I wish they was too small for you so I could have them. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy though. I ain't think I was gonna like the 350s, but I gotta say, I think I like the 350s now. So I'm definitely get y'all an on foot video for these. We got the Yeezy 350 V2 Oreo. Uh, of course, you know, we got that boost in there. As I say, anytime you got boost, you definitely got a comfortable shoe. They say this is the most comfortable Yeezy period, the 350s. Once I wear them, which I'm probably gonna wear them today, but once I give them a full day as well, I'll let y'all know what I think about the comfort levels on these joints. But these bitches are, I like them. It's my first 350, man. And I definitely think that I could appreciate the 350s now. Now I hope I don't start trying to really get 350s cause it's already crazy. January was dry. We ain't have a lot of easy releases. February, we had some decent releases, but I, I ain't gonna lie, I took a lot of L's in February. But March, March we made up for that for sure. I got a couple more Yeezys coming in, so y'all get reviews on them. I don't know, yeah, you gonna have to change the name. Y'all probably have to get up with Oreo or something and change the name, because it looked like the people spoke in these called the 350 V2 Oreos. I can rock with that. I'm glad I hit on these. This was like a perfect pair for me to get to try. I did want the uh, blue striped ones. Those are the ones I was looking at first. I took an L on those, but I hit on these. I think this was the better hit for me because it's more of a versatile shoe. I could do more with it as, as far as like wearing it with you know different outfits, blacks, nudes, shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Leave a comment below though. Let me know what y'all think about the 350 V2 Oreo. Let me know what y'all opinion is on the 350 in general. What's y'all favorite Yeezy silhouette and what's y'all favorite Yeezy 350 V2 colorway? Leave a comment below on all of that. I want to know all the details from y'all, man. Know what it is? It's Marlo. This is I'm Not a Sneakerhead. And we out. Dang. I keep grinding till I'm shining. shining. I know niggas watching, hating. I don't even mind it. It's about timing. I know this shit mad, so I don't even time it. If it's money out here anywhere, it's gonna always find me. Yeah, uh, yeah. This that different talk, different cloth My Uncle G died a legend, that made me a living boss Blizzy on me so much, if it ain't then I be feeling all Convertible, up in vertical, and drop your ceiling all uh, From the ground up to the T-top, I can't be stopped Niggas bite so much, it's like they selling re -rock. Niggas bite? Known below them near any block He gon' get his set knocked off for trying to be some shit that he not I'm my fucking self, it's gon' always be that way if nothing else Got money call, if I don't get it one way, I got something else Heard he got a deal, he on the fucking shelf Almost a million streams with just a team in my motherfucking self She say that she love me, bitch, I love me too Same people that judge me, wish they was me too I done paid Been waiting on my chance, coming like the hood up